Adenylylation, Wikipedia article audio. Adenylylation, now known as AM pylation, is a process in which adenosine monophosphate molecule is covalently attached to a protein side chain, altering the function of the protein. This covalent addition of AMP to a hydroxyl side chain of the protein is post-translational modification that is stable and reversible. Adenylylation involves a phosphodiester bond between a hydroxyl group of the molecule undergoing adenylylation and the phosphate group of the adenosine monophosphate nucleotide. This process can occur to molecules such as tyrosine residues. Enzymes that are capable of catalyzing this process are called ampulators. Similar to serine, threonine, or tyrosine phosphorylation, AM pylation regulates the activity of some proteins, such as glutamine synthetase. Additionally, AM pylation aids in allowing thermodynamically unfavorable overall reactions to take place by generating a leaving group in chemical mechanisms that indirectly use energy from ADP hydrolysis. Unstable carboxylate phosphate mixed anhydrides or of phosphoramidates are generated in this transient adenylation reaction. Function Ampulators The degree of adenylylation depends on the ratio of glutamine to alpha-ketoglutarate, the higher this ratio the more monomers are adenylylated, thereby producing lower activity of glutamine synthetase. The lower the ratio the less monomers are adenylated and the higher activity of glutamine synthetase. A high ratio is a sign of cellular nitrogen sufficiency, whereas a low ratio is evidence of a limited nitrogen and the need for ammonia fixation by glutamine synthetase. Ampulators are enzymes that catalyze AM pylation. These enzymes have been shown to be comparable to kinases due to their ADP hydrolysis activity and reversible transfer of the metabolite to a hydroxyl side chain of the protein substrate. To date, the ampulators that have been identified are bacterial proteins. Two domains, the FIC and adenyl transferase domains are the currently known ampulators that have been shown to be involved in pathogenicity of bacterial species and metabolic regulation. FIC domains are evolutionarily conserved domains in prokaryotes and eukaryotes that belong to the FIDO domain superfamily, whereas the adenyl transferase domains are part of the larger nucleotidal transferase protein family. GT passes are common targets of ampulators. Rho, Rab, and ARF GT passe families are involved in actin cytoskeleton dynamics and vesicular trafficking. They also play roles in cellular control mechanisms such as phagocytosis in the host cell, in which the pathogen enhances or prevents its internalization by either inducing or inhibiting host cell phagocytosis. Bacteria proteins, also known as effectors, have been shown to use AM pylation. Effectors such as VOPS, IBPA, and DRRA, have been shown to ampulate host GT passes and cause actin cytoskeleton changes. Vibrio parahemolyticus or VOPS is a gram-negative bacterium that causes food poisoning as a result of raw or undercooked seafood consumption in humans. VOPS contains a FIC domain that has a conserved HPFX GNR motif that contains a histidine residue essential for AM pylation. VOPS blocks actin assembly by modifying threonine residue in the switch 1 region of Rho GT passes. The transfer of an AMP moiety using ADP to the threonine residue results in steric hindrance, and thus prevents Rho GT passes from interacting with downstream effectors. As a result, the host cell's actin cytoskeleton control is disabled, leading to cell rounding. AM pylation and pathogenicity 
IBPA is secreted into eukaryotic cells from H. somni, a gram-negative bacterium in cattle that causes respiratory epithelium infection. This effector contains two FIC domains at the C-terminal region. AM pylation of the IBPA FIC domain of Rho family GT passes is responsible for its cytotoxicity. The AM pylation on a tyrosine residue of the switch 1 region blocks the interaction of the GT passes with downstream substrates such as PAC. GSATase is an ampulator that has been shown to catalyze de ampulation of glutamine synthetase by removing the covalent linkage between AMP and a hydroxyl residue of a protein. It contains two adenyl transferase domains that are involved in the addition and removal of AMP to glutamine synthetase. De ampulation occurs at the end terminus of the domain. Following the removal of AMP from glutamine synthetase, GSATase forms ADP and unmodified glutamine synthetase. Deambulation